How to use the blur tool in Photoshop. Now, this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. So, if you follow along by the end of this video, you will be able to use the blur tool in Photoshop. Okay, so to do this, uh, first of all, you just want to load up your project. Now, before we do anything, I would actually recommend that you go down here and make a duplicate of whichever layer you are going to blur because it's actually pretty hard to see changes until you go back. Now I'll show you what I mean. So make sure you have a duplicated layer and then what we can actually do now is start blurring this. So all you need to do is go over to this section on or this toolbar I should say on the left hand side and choose the blur tool. It looks like a raindrop. So click on this and then we have a few options. So the first thing is the strength. Uh, now it's relatively weak anyway, so I recommend you put this up to 100%. Uh, you can turn it down at any time though. Then we can choose the size of the brush. And if I actually turn this on, there we go. You can choose the size of the brush as well as the hardness. So if I just go for um, this size right here and I start blurring. So if I now just go and, I don't know, let's, bl let's blur her eye just like that. You can see that it that's getting very blurry. If you compare one eye to the other, um, that's very blurry right there. We'll do it to the other eye. And then maybe the lips as well, we can make blurry. Now, if we go back and you actually compare this to the other one, and this is why I said, uh, make sure you make a copy. Because you can see that it actually does make quite a big difference, but it's just hard to notice while you're actually doing this. Anyway, that is how you can blur an image in Photoshop. Thank you for watching.